So, uh, yeah, we're in Borderlands 3 right now. Um, we're gonna continue with this. I'm gonna talk about it <clears throat> for a bit, as I apparently have something in my throat from screaming because I have been, um, not enjoying trying to find a new place at all. I've been hating it, um, prolifically. Um, I've been hating it so much. I don't like house hunting. Um, and I bought myself this game as a kind of a reward for getting through house hunting. Um, I'll be honest with you and say that, um, if you are house hunting, if you just started, um, you're gonna wanna have a, give yourself a bit of time, you know, um, you're gonna be spending a few months doing it. It's gonna be pretty full on and you're gonna have to be patient. Hey, hey! Did, did you just say hey, hey to me? Hi, Lorelei. Do you think you'll have that job done soon? Oh, thanks, Lorelei. I appreciate that. Um, this game is strange. This game is strange because um, it it is it's 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 pretty um it's pretty hit and miss for me. And that's a weird thing to say, especially for someone who spent like maybe four hours playing yesterday. Um, it crashed twice at what I was playing it. Um, it crashed twice. And, uh, for me, you know, that's not great. That's pretty terrible. Pretty terrible form. Um, what I need from a game is to be stable at the settings that NVIDIA offer it, and then a little bit below. Um, but I can't even get this game to run consistently, um above 60 frames per second, and I've got a 2080 and a 2700X. Um, this game doesn't run well with 120 FPS at all. Um, th I'm using DX11, you know, and I understand that DX11 is kind of, um, you know, they want you to use DX12 maybe, I don't, I don't know. But then there's a DX12 loading bug. Um, I think the justific- See what I mean? Like, I'm trying to climb up here, but my character doesn't- Oh, you just hold. I guess you just hold space. Um... The, the game has some severe frame drops. It's very stuttery. Even at 60fps there are some frame stutters. There are performance issues, I think, part because I've got the Nervo running on this thing, which is just... Shit. Excuse the language, it's just terrible. Hey, sugar. Moxie here. And um... Those Calypso twins live for attention, right? So I say we take it away by turning their own broadcast towers against them. That turn it off. Uh, what am I supposed to be doing here? That COV probably is driving me up the wall. But you've sure got my frequency locked in, sugar. That's not family friendly. That's that's some innuendo right there. There's a whole lot of innuendo in this game. Um, I, I'm pretty 50-50 on it personally. I, I'm 28. Um, Claptrap has a new... Yeah, I, I have to admit. Can you actually just... There we go, go. Cool. The, the, I have to admit that the Claptrap voice actor is, is not bad. You know, um... Fill in the shoes of the uh, one that Randy Pitchard allegedly assaulted and didn't pay royalties to. Um, he's done pretty well. I'm not sure why you would bother working for someone who didn't pay royalties. Or who assaulted you. I personally wouldn't work for anyone that assaulted me. And I don't blame the original voice actor for leaving. But of course these are allegations. Um, so I'll be honest. Um, to, to be really honest, this game is kind of... I'll finish it. But it's one of those kind of games like Destiny 3 where it's just an open world kind of thing with bigger maps. And that's supposed to be impressive. Um, but we've had Skyrim. I have a pet by the way. Um, I have a pet, and he's Mr. Chu, and uh, I think Mr. Chu is a good man. I don't know why 
I don't know what is happening. Oh! I'm gonna probably die from this, aren't I? Maybe. You know, I think an important question to ask when you're playing a video game is, is this better than Destiny 2? And I'd say that there's more variety in Destiny 2. I'd say this game in some parts is better written than Destiny 2, but in also in other parts. It's just completely depressing. Um, I miss Scooter. I miss Scooter a lot. I like that my character talks. I like that he talks. He talks a lot though. I'm not sure how much I like him talking a lot. Um, I like the detail they put into the worlds. I don't like the fact that they used a Nuvo and so having to render this gigantic massive world on ultra settings is just a complete pain. Um, I don't like that I can't um, get a catcher right here. Oh no, I can. Never mind, it does work. Um, this, this vehicle is cool, and you can do like, I don't know, turbo speed and stuff. Um, that is a mission I've got to go to, but that's a story mission, and I figure if I'm not going to do a full let's play of this, I may as well not do a story mission. I'll just drive around for a bit. Um, because there is a lot to see in these maps, and you can go through different planets as well, which is kind of dope. Um, and, uh, you know, I'm frozen now. And I'm, I'm dead. Glad to have you back. And, uh... My character doesn't really have uh, reactions to things that some things that happen. You know, like there's very generic. I'm um, like, oh, that happened. Hello. That's good that that happened. Um, but he'll just usually just say, oh, thank you for not dying, dog. And you'll be on your way. And he uses the same 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 voice thing whenever he whenever he jumps hello there hunter hi hi um i wish this game didn't try so hard to be call of duty um i understand that they wanted to push the 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 um the technology to a point where it could be very interesting for people to play and um um, you know, I, I can imagine that it was probably quite fun, like, I guess to, and to begin with, to imagine, you know, oh, yeah, I'll, um, can I, can I go there? I can't go there. Um, let's just see how fast we can push a 2800 or 280, 2080 or 2080 Ti. <clears throat> I think that's... I think that a, a, a reasonable minimum requirement for gaming these days is that you can run 1080p at 120 FPS on higher ultra settings. Um, and this could do high, it can't do ultra. Not on a 2080 and a 2700X. And I know I'm probably sort of CPU limited there. Um, and I will get myself a... But see these frame stutters? This is unacceptable. Why are these so much higher now? Oh, well, I guess we can't go here, can we? Yeah, I'm on the hard mode as well, by the way. Um, can I go to the global mode? Can I get out of that? Can I go to global mode, please? I want to go to... Pandora. Oh, you can just do that. That's so. That's actually a lot better. I think the reason that they allowed you to sort of do this uh, mid um, mid level is just because otherwise you'd be going from one end of the level to the other. Um, so that was Pandora. That's where you find Maya or Maya. And you can just go through quests like this. My dogs and covers the aftertaste. Harvest some of those succulent succulents and you get paid. Oh yeah. 
Right, you're gonna need a special gun to harvest those succulents. I call it the big suck. Because well, it harvests succulents. Whatever, I'm a chef, not a namer of things. I used to be culinary royalty. Shut up. One of my rivals spread a rumor that my skag dogs were full of dead skin and toenails. And yeah, while it's technically true, you, you never reveal a chef's secret recipe under the penalty of death. Anyway, my culinary empire crumbled, and I changed my name. For now. What are you? I... Did they see the performance drops? No idea. No idea why it's like this. I'm guessing I have to go through here. Good to see you, my boy. Yep, and my cat's up the top as well, which is great. As long as she doesn't bump the mic, I don't mind. Hey, Nush. Hey, those var kids. Um, it's it saddens me that they couldn't fix the graphical issues on this game after a few weeks of it being released. Um, it saddens me that they didn't bother to try and fix the graphical issues full stop. Um, I think it could have been. I mean, I know what he's referring to in that. I'm not going to talk about it in a. In a video like this. Oh wow. This this performs worse than Borderlands 2. By a long shot. Um Now, go harvest some succulent cacti fruit. Those bad boys taste so goddamn delicious my customers won't care what they're eating, which is how I prefer it. And don't you dare judge me. If serving people toenail clippings and dead skin is wrong, I don't wanna be right. Yeah, that's great. That's cool. So we're gonna we're gonna do a uh, we're gonna continue, right? I guess I go back to my ship. Don't hold back. I, <laughs> I like the added responsiveness from the enemies. I think some of the enemies are more sort of emotive than they used to be, which is good. Um, I like that there's little hidden kind of collectibles that you can get now, as opposed to just kind of like the vault thing, and that you had in like previous systems. Hey, Nush. Yeah. I don't think Nushka likes me playing video games as much um, as she used to. I think she used to size more attention. So I make sure that I pet her whenever she comes up, just so she gets lots of cuddles. Hey, Nushki. I only play like a few hours a day, but still, for a cat, a few hours is quite a long time. Hey, puss. Hey. I don't know. See, the cool thing is you can just go backwards and forwards, so I can pet my cat and play Borderlands at the same time. Alright, where is this next? So you can see I'm in like a wheel. There are some cool, um... There's a grand total of uh, four vehicles, I think, in this game. Hey, boss. Oh, look at you. Hey, you got this. Hey, you got this. Hey, yo. How you doing? Hey, jugger, jugger, jugger. Hey, jugger, 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 jugger. Hey, jugger, 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 look at you. You're a good cat. You're a good cat. All right, and we're gonna go in there, right? Cool. Come on, boy. Now about the big suck. Its secondary function is what we call in the biz splash damage. No, I'm actually offended by this. This game is actually starting to irritate me now. Um. It's a, it's a... It's time to fight! Try it. Grab the skag. 
days you hunt, some days you hunt. At least using like a uh, a sniper rifle. I'm pretty good at using a sniper rifle without the scope. Also helps when you're twice the level of your enemies. Um. What am I supposed to be doing with this? The big suck. Okay. Did I, did I win? What, what was the point of this? Hey, no sh- Here's a very weird mission, isn't it? Man, well, you don't keep with your cuddles. It's kind of just, kind of just devolved into me petting a cat whilst I play. Not that you're able to see what's happening, but I think that's fine. Um. these. What will I do? Oh, I've been pretty, pretty, pretty overwhelmed. Mm. I mean, I've got V-Sync on. I think that's really important to note. Is I've got V-Sync on. See that, though? Did you see that? That's what we're dealing with with this game. I don't have these issues in any other title I play. Um... And it's weird to me that they've allowed this in this state. I don't even really care about the skags anymore, to be really honest. That's the spirit. There you go. Where is the alpha? Where is the alpha? Where is the alpha? Oh yeah, he goes big. Is where is the alpha? Is he down here? Is he just not spawn yet? Is that the issue? Did Okay. Oh, he's this way. There's a diamond. There's a diamond pointing to him. I'm gonna use the big zuck on him. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah, so funny. So funny. Come on, buddy. Chef's life is not for me. Well, being a chef ain't for everybody. Now go grab that skag meat. Ah! Goodness. Was I supposed to be impressed after killing something with it? This- that's the writing in this game, by the way. Um, this quest, that's the writing. It looks like somebody's been poaching my succulents. Which means in chef code that they must die. Gotta be the bandit chef mincemeat. Go kill him! Oh, it's all coming together. Soon I'll make my spatula wielding rival pay for what he's done. But first, we'll make my new rival mincemeat pay. Listen, a chef.
chef's life is half revenge killing. It's a thing. <laughs> Truffle munch and butt munch. Why do you run like this? I'm actually watch out for mincemeat skags, truffle munch and butt munch. They will munch anything, including you. I could kill for the calypso. Finally, my reward. Have fun running. Enrage. Can I go away from the big suck now? Or can I... Like... Is it over? Is it, is it done? Did I do it? Do I have to go sit? I have to go all the way up. I should probably help my dude out. Stop. Go away. You're annoying. All right. Do I have ammo for the big? <sighs> no. Hi. Okay, we can go this way, right? Please, please, can we go this way? Um. Ammo isn't as much in abundance as it has been in other Borderlands games. I do miss, you know, having ammo most of the time. Um, it's not something I've experienced in this. Um, ammo is rare. Maybe it's just because I chose hard mode? I am confused. Here we go. Probably focus on um, helping him out. There you go. Oh, hello. Ha ha ha. Hi, dude. Do I have an ammo? How did I shoot him in the head? And I missed. Cool. Are we good? No, we've still got you. I don't have any ammo, do you? Oh, I have enough ammo in my butt munch. Oh. My, my, my... Grab the meat. <sighs> dogs off. Still seems weird. I don't like killing the puppies. Excellent kill, boy. Over. Where is the mate? Of it. Nothing here, no. I think we're good to go. Yeah, we'll continue. Got a bit of money here. Money, 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 money. Nicely done. A few more skags and I'll be able to advertise my skag dogs have fifty percent meat. Drop the ingredients off and you get paid. Thank you. Oh, what's happening here? Hey, buddy. Oh, he's a happy... He's a happy pup. I, I, this is why I chose him, by the way. I wanted to have a pet friend throughout the entire game that didn't die at the end for sort of 
artificial tension or anything like that. I don't like it when pets die in games. It never makes me feel particularly good. It feels kind of a lazy way to pull emotion from someone. Hey, that pet you liked? Yeah, we don't know how else to make you feel sad, so we're gonna make you feel sad by having a pet die. It's literally, death is the only way we can think of making you sad. Um, oh, excuse me. Here we go. We are good. Right. That'll teach that arrogant spatula wheeling bastard. As soon as people taste my new and improved skag dogs, I'll be at the top of the culinary establishment once again. <clears throat> and you'll get free skag dogs for life. Hope you're hungry. Sure, dude. What are they doing? Why are they flying in place? Oh, they're not anymore. I'm, I, I don't know. This game is a bit of a 50-50 for me. It's, it's, it's obviously, like, it's got enough content for it to be worth your time. Um, you'll, en you'll enjoy probably quite... Do they just, does it just take your gun at the end? That's a bit cheeky. You know, you, you get lots of cool weapons, I guess. Um. Uh. Here we go. Did I get a better one of that? 13. Excellent. I still don't know how to use, um, grenades. I missed you, boy. Is it like... Is it G? It is G! <sighs> That's clever. Feel the bloodlust! You there. How are your last breaths? This was always your end. That's the first time I've been like, hey, you know what? Clever, clever move, game. I don't miss having random birds attacking me out of the sky. I, I don't miss that very much. Um. But I guess that's just par for the course, isn't it? What you doing, buddy? I think that's basically all I'm going to do. Um, it's run surprisingly well, considering I've been using Shadow Play with it, so I suppose it's just having Ultra settings that bugs it out. Or maybe it can handle Ultra at 60, I don't know. Maybe 60 FPS is just the right cap for it, maybe it's not optimized for 120 FPS and that's why it crashes. Um, To be fair, the benchmark for Ultras is 80, so I suppose having it at 60 is probably good. Anyways, I'm gonna go now, and um, I guess I will see you in the next video, which I'll probably put out tomorrow. And uh, yeah, this was fun. This was a fun little excursion. I think I'm probably about good to go. And any more gameplay of this until I, unless I see something incredibly sort of amazing, will probably just be done in my own time. As I don't really want to spoil it too much for you. I think this video has covered most, if not all, of the kind of stuff you'll come across in this game. The highs and the lows. Good to see you, my boy. Yeah. Um, so see you later. Thank you very much for watching and bye-bye.